Hello, my dear students. I'm Ms. Batul Masoud. Today, our lesson is See the Light. Before we start, let's revise what we've learned last week. We learned about the energy. Energy is something that can cause matter to move or change. There is three kinds of energy, heat, light, and sound. We learned about the heat. You can feel heat from many things. What are the sources of heat? Heat from the sun warms earth. Rubbing your hands together warms them up. Burning fuels gives off heat. Today we're going to learn about the second kind of energy, which is light. Light is a form of energy that helps us see. We use light in many different ways. Lights in a classroom help you see your work. The overhead lights in a classroom are a source of light. Everyone can see their work while in the room. A computer screen gives off light. Computers, televisions, and other electronic devices give off light. This lets us see an image on the screen. A lighthouse helps ships find their way. A lighthouse has very powerful lights that shine through the night sky. The light helps ships stay away from the rocky shore. Car headlights help a driver see the road. Drivers need the headlight on a car to see the road at night. Light from the sun helps plants make food. The sun is an important source of light. Plants use light from the sun to make their own food. How are the things around you affected by the amount of light they get? The amount of light can affect how well you can see things. A plant might not grow as much if it doesn't get much light. Now we're going to watch this video to see how the amount of light can affect how well you can see things. When the amount of light is increased or decreased, colors appear brighter or dimmer. Here, the moonlight fades and the sun is coming up. The sky is becoming brighter. Now the sun is higher in the sky, the colors are bright now. Plants are using the light from the sun to make food. Now the sun is beginning to set, the colors are starting to become dimmer and the air is cooling. Here, the sun has gone down. It's hard to see colors and shapes. The air has cooled. Okay, now I want you to open your science book, the physical science book. On page 388, please write the date at the top of the page. See the light. The sun, electric lights, and fire all give off light. Light is energy that lets you see. The amount of light can change how you see things. The amount of light can change how you see the color of an object. Adding more light can make an object look brighter and taking away light can make an object look dimmer. How much light? Different materials let different amounts of light pass through. A window pane, for example, lets all the light pass through it and a lampshade lets some of the light pass through it and a door lets no light pass through it. Now I want you to name something else that lets no light pass through. 
Now, how do the colors of the water and rocks look in this picture? They look dim and dark. Why? Because the light is low. Low light makes colors look dim. So here I want you to highlight this. It looks dim and low light. In this picture, the color of the water and rocks looks bright because it's in bright light. So they look bright and colorful because the light is bright. Bright light makes colors look bright. On this page, I want you to highlight that the light is energy that lets you see. I want you to highlight that the amount of light can change how you see the color of an object. Adding more light can make an object look brighter and taking away light can make an object look dimmer. Now the amount of light passes through objects I want you to highlight that some of them lets all the light pass through it and let some light pass through and no light pass through. Please after you're done solve this question, take a picture of your answers and send it back to me. So today we've learned that the sun, electric lights and fire all give off light. Light is energy that lets you see and the amount of light can change how you see things. Adding more light can make an object look brighter and taking away light can make an object look dimmer. That's all for today. I hope it was clear. Thank you.